Yeah, so I got back here to Chickasha last night, and uh, this morning I woke up and I went down to the family dollar to try and get some supplies, some water and whatnot, and um, the place got burned up. It caught on fire yesterday. They had a fire in the back, and anyways, just in case anybody tries to blame that on me, I was in Oklahoma City all day yesterday I didn't get back here until like 10 8 o'clock at night and I was and I stayed in Oklahoma City the night before because the day before yesterday in the morning that's the day when I got a ride right after I recorded that video the other morning at the at the sports complex I recorded that video live on Facebook Right, but that was right before, like 20 minutes later, I went to Oklahoma City and I stayed there for a couple of days and now I came back. So anyways, I just got back here, but I went up there to get some supplies this morning and the place was closed. And I thought, well, that's weird. And uh, now, I, now I know why. Okay, I looked through the window and every, everything looked like smoke and fire and it stinks real bad. It smells like smoke. So, anyways, it wasn't me though. It had nothing to do with me. I was, I was in uh, Oklahoma City, and and the bus service they have me on camera riding the bus twice the day before yesterday and three times yesterday. So, throughout the day, throughout both of those days. So I was in Oklahoma City the entire time. So whatever happened here had nothing to do with me at all. Anyways, just for the record, you know. Good morning. Check this out. Here's the railroad tracks right here. And right there is Dollar Dollar General. I was here the other day and um I was here three three nights ago, two nights ago, something like that. Anyways, I jumped off the train and I slept literally right on the front porch of that Dollar General. And then um, the police came and kicked me off the, the, the next morning. They woke me up. And then that the next night I slept down at the sports complex way down there. It's like, where can you see my hand? It's way down there. But the next morning, the next morning um, somebody gave me a ride up to Oklahoma City. And I hung out there for a couple days trying to catch a train. Until last night, I ended up taking a lift to come back here. But uh, anyways, I'm going to show you that. Look at this. I haven't been. I, I went back here. I got back here this morning or last night. And I went up to Dollar General this morning thinking they were open. And uh, let me show. I'll, I'll show you what happened. Check this out. I just came around back and look at the all the burnt carts. Look at all this stuff. What a trip. this you can just go right inside is that crazy or what I want to get a video holy cow it stinks really bad in here look so that's where the fire was I had no idea you could just walk right in here place is messed up oh look at all this oh man this is an insurance job right here whoa the floor is like goop 
It's like mud. This is crazy. I've never seen nothing like this before. Alright, so now I'm up at the front of the store. Now you can see it from the inside. Yeah, wow. Look at this. Everything smells like smoke. This place smells like smoke really bad. It looks like last night somebody raided the cigarette thing. That's probably who broke in through that back door last night. Because this happened just yesterday. And this is the first time I've come in here is just right now because it was already open. You seen when I walked up. It looks like they came in just to steal cigarettes. Which, I don't know. Everything in here will get thrown away anyways because of the smoke damage, but uh, usually an insurance will have to pay for it. But look, I wanna, I'll show you these, these, uh, these Coke bottles. <clears throat> look at these, see this is where the, look at all this damage. Wow, this is horrible. This is going towards the back of the store. The fire happened all the way in the back. But look at these Coke bottles. Look at how they're all deformed. And everything is like black from the smoke. I'm pretty sure everything in this store will have to get thrown away. Anyways, uh, today's Saturday, October 9th, and I got back here to this town last night. Um, I paid a Lyft driver. I took a Lyft to get back here because the it's easier to hop a train here than it, than it is over there. Anyways, I came here this morning because I was going to get some supplies for the train, and look at the, look at the window. It's all weird looking in there. See all the black lines? The windows are all dirty. Check this, it smells like smoke right here. I don't know what the hell is going on here, but this thing says uh, something fire investigation. Is that a trip or what? Look at the date. So it happened yesterday. Whatever happened here happened yesterday when I was in uh, Oklahoma City. But they got the, it's not even open. Everything's all shut down right now. There ain't even no workers here. It's just straight up shut down. That must be this from the sprinklers, the sprinklers and the water. That's crazy. Are the sprinklers and the smoke? That's crazy. Yeah, I was hoping to grab some supplies and then go back to the tracks to catch a to wait for a train, but uh, I had to walk. Luckily, there's another grocery store up there. There's another grocery store just a couple blocks up on the left. So, but uh, yeah. That's